بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم أعزائي طلاب وطالبات الصف العاشر من التعليم الأساسي بسلطنة عمان أهلا ومرحبا بكم معي على قناتي أنا مستر هاني إسماعيل Our dear grade 10 students of سلطنة عمان Welcome you to my channel I am Mr. Hani Ismail, a teacher of English. Today we are going to start our unit one. Unit one is the new media. But before we uh, explaining the uh, unit one, we are going to look at the page of the content of this course book. Unit one, new media, page one, two, Climate change, unit 2, page 13. Unit 3, renewable energy, page 25. And unit 4, civilization, page 37. Here we should look carefully at the learning outcomes for grade 10A. The important, the, the important point for us is unit 1. We are going to study unit 1, so we are going to read carefully the objectives of unit one in this unit you will be able to read a variety of reading texts including an article summarizes and charts listen to a variety of listening texts including an interview and a podcast use a vocabulary related to new media make comparisons using different comparative structures for form and use phrasal verbs discuss issues related to new media make and respond to suggestions interpret visual data in charts write a summary comparing two pie charts work in a team to design a blog so read the learning outcomes very carefully Activity 1. Read and match. Match the pictures A to I with the words 1 to 14 in the box. There are 5 extra words. Look at the pictures and tell me. What's picture number A? A is a TV. Good. Number B. What are they? It's a picture of WhatsApp, uh, Instagram, YouTube, Snapchat. It's a social platform. Social media platform number four, 14. Yes, number C. What What can you see in picture number C? It's a blog. Yes, number three. Number D. Number D. It's a video streaming. It's a video streaming. Where is video streaming? Number nine. Number E. Number E, it's a website. It's a website. Number seven. Number F is a magazine. Number one. Yes, good. After that, it is a stereo. It is a stereo. Number G is a stereo. H. H, a video game. Yes, it's a video game. Number I is a, is a newspaper. Yes, it's a newspaper. Now, we are going to do activity two. Activity two, listen and think. Listen to the three people describing different types of media. Which type of media is person talking about? Unit 1 Listening 1.1 1. 1. 1. I think it's more important than television because it can reach everyone. Whether you're rich or poor, whether you live in the city or live in the desert, you can hear about what's happening in the world. Nowadays, you can get ones that run on solar power or that wind up so you don't need batteries anymore. 2. 
Many people read these every day. They like to read them in the morning. Traditionally, they were printed. But these days, most of them are also available online. 3. These are online platforms where people can connect with other people. They have made communication much easier. We can scroll through other people's pictures, posts, updates and comments. Now, after we, we listen, the answers are number one, radio, number two, newspaper, number three, social media. After that, activity three, read and discuss. Work, number one, work in pairs, read the text and discuss the questions. New media, the term new media describes forms of media that are interactive and allow users to digitally communicate with each other. New media can be accessed on computers, smartphones and tablets. And it includes social media, blogs, video games, and online news sites. New media has made it easier to share our lives, to communicate with family and friends, and to connect with people all over the world. Question number one. What does new media mean? New media, it is forms of media that are interactive and allow users to digitally communicate with each other number two what different types of new media are mentioned in the text social media blogs video games and online new sites very good question number three which types of new media do you use of course we use social media, online news, sites, and video games. That's for me. What about you? Activity 2. Look at the vocabulary in bold. Discuss the meaning of these words. We are going to reach the meaning of these new words, the whole unit, new vocabs at the end of our explanation okay at the end of this video you are going to to meet these new meanings of the vocabs now work in a group discuss activity four discuss work in groups and discuss the following question imagine if you had a, 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 a to spend the whole day without using any social media what would you it be like how would you feel of course i know I, I know your feeling it's a very boring thing it's something nowadays as impossible to to happen but try to discuss it activity one page two read and discuss look at the picture and discuss the questions number one what do you think the teenagers in the picture are doing? The teenagers in the picture might be playing with the phones, playing at games, texting, or looking at social media, etc. Number two, what do you think the word screenager might mean? Screenager informal teenagers who spend a lot of time in front of a screen. This word is a blend of words screen plus teenager. After that, activity two, read and choose. Read the article and decide which statement is not true. You are going to read the whole text of screenagers. Screenagers, I told you the meaning of screenagers, a person who spend most of his time in front of screen or in front of their phones, television and so on. After you read, you are going to answer this question. 
read the article and decide which statement is not true. Number one, many teenagers are addicted to their smartphones. Number two, teenagers spend off most of their time in front of screens. Number three, excessive screen time is negative regardless of content. Number four, too much screen time can affect teenagers negatively. So, where is the sentence which is not true? Number three, yes, excessive screen time is negative regardless of content. Number three is not true. Now we read chapter 3. Read and answer. Read the article in, in activity 2 again and answer the questions blue. According to the article, on average, how many hours per day do teenagers spend online? The answer is 9 hours. Question 2. What problems can excessive screen time cause? It can harm the brain's development and reduce young people people's attention spans question number three which is the most popular social media platform for the this age group youtube question four do all video games contain violent content no Number five, what do you think the writer means in the statement, the content and the context of a teenager's screen use is more important than the, the amount of time they spend in front of a screen? It, it means time spent in front of a screen should not always be considered a negative issue if the content a teenager is looking at is informative, helpful, uh, or useful. Activity 4. Read and match. Look at the word and expressions in bold in article in activity 2. Match them to the meaning is blue. Number 1. The lens of the, the length of time of which a person is able to concentrate on a particular activity. It means attention span. Number two, a person who was born or has grown up since the use of digital technology beco became common. It is a digital native, digital native, sorry digital natives okay number three to pay very close attention to something especially a television it means glued to number four more than necessary or normal excessive good number five when a person uses something uncomfortably for example smartphones computers and gaming systems addicted to number six something that happens as a result of a particular action or set of action or uh, 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 set of conditions it means consequences Number seven, to play video online without downloading them. It means streaming videos. Number five, discuss. Activity five, okay. Ask you to discuss the, the question, discuss the question with a partner. Use the expressions for giving your opinions from the useful language box in your discussion. Number one, you are going to discuss these two questions in groups and, or individually with yourself. You are going to uh, discuss these questions. Uh, why do you think it needs to spend too much time in front of screens? You are going to give us your opinion. 
Do you think online video games increase violent behavior? You are going to use this box used for language giving your opinion. How to give your opinion? To give your opinion, you should say, in my opinion. I think, or I believe, I feel that, or based on my experience, I think that. So you are going to discuss these two questions in pairs, in groups, individuals, individually, but you are going to discuss them by saying, in my opinion, in my opinion, I think, I believe, I feel that, based on my own experience, I think that. Here we reach our vocabs of the whole unit. Number one, addicted, addicted to. I am really addicted to video games. Awesome. Number two, adjective. We had an awesome summer vacation. Number three, blog noun. I started a personal blog to share my diary and project this online. For blogger, now, food bloggers post famous recipe online and everyone likes them. Blogging, if you want to make money, keep blogging new posts in your website. Brand, what brand of shampoo do you use? Bring up, brought up, verb, he was born and brought up in India. Command, now, she made helpful comments on my work, communicate, verb, nowadays people communicate by sending WhatsApp messages, consequences, many houses were destroyed as a consequence of a hurricane, content, noun, the article was well structured, but if didn't, it didn't have much content, cyber, Bullying. Now, cyberbullying is particularly common between teenagers who use the internet negatively. Deal with verb means she can deal with her problems by herself. Device. It's a noun. The store sells TVs, VCRs, and other electric, electronic devices. Digital age, noun, the time period in which we live now, where internet and email are available, is an example of the digital age. Digital native, noun, Sarah, is digital, a digital native as she has grown up using technology. Excessive, adjective, he is drinking an excessive amount of soft drinks, which is an unhealthy thing. Fake news. The story about the mother who killed her son was fake news. Glued to adjective. He is glued to TV and spends all his day watching TV. Hang up. Verb. She phoned her friend and decided to hang up suddenly as her mom called her. Hurry up. Verb. Hurry up. You will miss the bus. Illustrate. Verb. The current issues of Time and News Week illustrate the problem. Journalism noun. I was to go. I sorry. I want to go to Harvard, Harvard University to study journalism and political science. Journalist noun. I want to be a journalist to write interesting reports in the newspaper. 
بودكاست ناو ليسن تو ذا بروجرام اون راديو اور داونلود ا بودكاست ريلاكتنت ادجكتيف ذا اكتريس سيمد ريلاكتنت تو جيف ذا انترفيو از شي وزنت ريدي سكرينيجر ناو اي كان نيفر جيت ماي سكرينيجرز تو جو بلاي اوتسايد significant adjective there is a significant difference between teenagers in spending their free time suggestions noun tom refused to even consider my suggestion trust and the last word it's a noun i can to lose trust in mariam as she is my friend since a childhood Thanks a lot. See you next video, Mr. Hani Ismail. I hope you to subscribe my channel.